over there. <laughs> yeah. All right, so today we are going to be doing a tribute video to uh, Matt V2099. Uh, he's one of my favorite YouTubers from back in the day there. Uh, he used to goof around, do all kinds of cool stuff, like zip ties and some tape, and Weston's working on some bubble gum here. Mm. And it just reminded me, like, back when I was, man, back in, like, the early 90s, uh, me and my buddies used to always do that, like, back in the VHS recorder days, we had this big camera, we'd always do goofy stuff, so that's what I always liked about him, just messing around. So, but since, he doesn't really do anything anymore, so I don't blame him. But anyway, since then, technology in that field came a long way, like today, we have Gorilla Tape, we have some Flex Tape, mm -hmm. which is super strong, Zip Ties, we got major upgrade in Zip Ties, and... Is blue, blue helping you with the hub, Hubba Bubba? What have we got? Some Bubble Max? Is it Hubba Bubba? Mm -hmm. We got some Hubba Bubba. Mm -hmm. That's really upgraded. We got like three packs of that. We're going to... Maybe giant. Yeah, we're going to see if this old 9mm can uh, cycle with it. So, let me get everything set up here and we'll get started. Okay, first up, we just got one single zip tie here. So this uh, new high quality. want to see if she cycles. Look like it did. Yup. Okay, we got one, two, three. Got four zip ties on here. Let's try her out. Ah. Nope. <laughs> four zip ties. It almost did. It came back pretty far. All right, let's try something else now. Okay, next up, we're going to do some uh, gorilla tape here. Going to put one... Yeah, whoops. About one one loop around her there. Maybe one and a half. Yeah, this is gorilla tape now. Actually I think that will work. I mean or not work, I should say. Let's see here. Did it cycle? Oh no. It didn't cycle at all. Look at that. Gorilla gorilla tape held her strong. <laughs> Okay, now here we got uh, flex tape. This stuff is super sticky, super expensive too. I only put on one side. I think I'll stop it. So let's see here. Yep, there it is. One little piece of flex tape. I wasn't ready. <laughs> Okay, I just wanted to pause the video here real quick. For some reason, the camera, it, like, picked up everything except for the shot, like, before and after. So, I don't know if that was my fault or what really happened there. But that was three packs of Hubba Bubba, and it definitely uh, jammed up the gun. It would not let it cycle. So, it was pretty cool. Pretty messy, though. Okay, this, look how absolutely disgusting disgusting this thing is it is so sticky and gross it's pretty cool though i'm gonna see what it does to the gumball <laughs> it went flying hell there it goes okay there it is yeah uh all the new and improved tapes Zip ties, hubba bubba, bubble gum, uh, everything stopped this from functioning. It's pretty fun though. Like I said, I always enjoyed watching his shows and stuff. So just screwing around, having a little fun. Uh, been real busy lately. Hopefully, I'll get all kinds of videos. I got all kinds of stuff to do coming up. Uh, a lot of people ask me how I clean my guns. Here, let me turn this away from old glory. I don't want to get my flag all dirty. Literally, stuff like this uh wd-40 like it works about the best you just it like cleans and lubricates at the same time and actually wd-40 is good for getting bubble gum out uh they i never tried it <laughs> they say if you get it in your hair it actually takes it off so you can see it's some of that tape still on there but it's coming right off there that's how I always clean my guns. Just WD-40, man. It seems uh, it's good, safe on plastic, but always test your firearm, firearm or whatever, uh, somewhere out of the way, just to make sure it doesn't damage it. But I never had WD-40 damage anything I had, so 
Yep. Let's just spray her down a few more times here and Oh, I got a couple things to add in in this video. We had uh we was out kayaking on the one lake and seen like a freaking river monster out there, didn't we, bud? <laughs> I think it might have been the big copperhead. I didn't get my camera on in time. It was like by his beer can floating there. It was huge. But I, I might put that in the end of the video. And it's, and it's Blue's birthday coming up, huh? So, all right. Yeah, see? Come pretty clean. I'm going to keep working on it. And <laughs> stay tuned. Okay, it's almost Blue's birthday. When is this? 19th? Is that his birthday? He's going to be six months old. Uh, he weighed, what, 96 pounds at the vet yesterday. So he's getting big. <laughs> but he's doing good. He's being a good dog, huh? He said when he did that to yesterday, loved the whole your drinks, you know? Yeah, yeah, he likes to get into drinks and food. Loves food, huh? Watch this, Blue. Hey, Blue, want a treat? Want a treat? <laughs> oh, he's going after a rooster. You better be careful, Blue. Where's he at? That rooster mess you up. Might be a big bullfrog right there. I don't know. Could be swamp thing around here. Let me go uh, investigate. 